I use offline music player applications a lot and when it is free and open source, I even love it better. No ads and boring UI. And this one called Pulse Music is one that suits my style perfectly. It has access to your library to be able to play all types of songs. You have these four buttons which are for songs you've made favorites, recently played songs, track picker to manually enter your phone storage to select a particular song, and then the shuffle button which creates a playlist of random songs. And of course, you get to create a new playlist and also the app has a sleep timer. The app interface is very cool and clean and minimal and still has more customization options in the settings. The now playing screen also has two additional styles to choose and apply and not forgetting the simple music minimal widget this application comes with, which is also customizable. So check out Pulse Music if you love free and open source music player applications. Recently, I showed you an application called Fast Lyrics, which automatically generates lyrics for any song you are currently playing on your phone. Now, similar to this application is called Rush. Well, with this application, you can search for lyrics to any song on the internet, whether you have it currently playing on your phone or not. And I prefer this to Fast Lyrics because this can actually find the accurate lyrics to any song you search, unlike Fast Lyrics, which searches based on the current music you are playing. So if it is an offline music, probably with a slightly different title, Fast Lyrics will not be able to find the right lyrics to the song. Rush works both ways, automatically listening and filling in with the lyrics or you manually searching for it. It works with the help of Genius Lyrics, which is one of the best websites that contains lyrics to billions of songs on the internet. The app stores every search you've made and also allows you to select and share part of the lyrics made in an awesome card to your social media stories or status, or even share with friends. If you have interest in keeping records of the little details in your daily life, you can use this application called Daily Counter to take control of this. So let's say you want to take records of many times you take in water daily, or take breaks from work, or even not to forget how many times you fed your pet. This application makes login very simple. Just tap the plus button to add the activity and once you make progress, you just tap the plus button to add that record. And on a user-friendly UI such as this application comes with, it makes the experience with the app very appealing and makes you come back to it every time. You can check the accumulated record of a particular activity by day, week, month or in total. And you can also check out the entire records of all activities combined. Overall, this is a very decent application to help you take control of your daily habits to improve and also to quit some bad ones. Moving on to this tool application, Taskbar is a very useful application which contributes to the 100 mode agenda of Android smartphones. With the application installed and enabled, it brings a dock containing 10 recently opened applications, which stays hidden until you bring it on the screen by tapping on the little arrow at the bottom corner of the screen. This makes it easier to access other applications without leaving your current screen and of course this is similar to entering the recent apps tab but this application has made it very quick and simple and also adds to a better Android user experience. More to this application, it has a menu button which once you tap on it will bring up your app drawer in a mini window also without leaving your current screen. So this makes it even far better. You can customize every feature this application brings including in the icon pack, the menu button icon, the start menu grid and position, you can increase or decrease the number of applications to show on the taskbar and so much more settings. Next application, Save on Device is a free and open source application which adds a save to device option to any share menu in any application which allows you to save various files to your device including audio recordings from chats, documents from scanner applications, even WhatsApp profile picture, since you cannot download it by default. So many more places where this application can be very useful. The app, once installed, stays in the background and serves its purpose. You cannot make any settings or whatsoever. I'll actually recommend it to you if you haven't tried it already. This weather application has a unique style and I really love it. It is called Just Weather and unlike most weather applications with more info and animations, graphics and a whole lot, which is all awesome, this one has a very simple and straightforward style. It has this static page which shows the basic weather information, 
which I presume is what's most needed. In the next tab, it shows the forecast in hourly interval in the settings tab where you enter the city name to see the weather information. This app does not request location permission for it to work since it lets you manually enter city name before it provides the weather information of that place. And it also comes with a very minimal widget which displays the current temperature. And once you tap on it, it takes you to the application. This is a clean, safe and secure weather application which you should try. This application allows me to track my savings on anything I want to buy and that's basically the functionality of this application. It is called Green Stash. And one thing I love about this application is allowing you to add a photo of whatever you want to buy. And personally, this motivates me and also reminds me about what I've decided to purchase. Adding an item is very easy and once you are done, you can then add deposits or withdraw. There is a progress bar just beneath the image to show where you are with your savings. You can tap on this icon to easily update your savings goal. When you have multiple saving goals, you can sort them out by amount, priority, title and more for quick access. The application comes with a clean and simple widget as well. It is a free and open source application with a very nice and clean Material U UI design. This key is a free and open source application which analyzes your phone storages and shows you how your spaces are being used by applications and files on your phone. It provides a clean and smooth experience in navigating the application, comes with a material you design which has dynamic theming. There are several storage management applications which are mostly full of ads and have pretty boring UI and even are not secure. This one is very secure and does not even have the ability to delete rename or edit your files. It only shows you how the spaces are being used. You probably might even use this application to get information to go ahead and create spaces if you don't need certain applications or files which will be made known by this application. If you really are concerned about security in smartphones and applications, then with Fossify applications, you can find some solace. They recently added Fossify keyboard which works very well and can be customized. The UI looks similar to Gboard and you can customize the height as well. I should mention that it lacks word suggestions, slight typing, both of which forms a great part of my typing experience. So I can't really say I will switch fully to this one. The clipboard works but in a weird way, copy text will be suggested whenever you are typing even if you don't need it. And the only solution is to delete it from the clipboard. But yes, so if you want a simple and secure keyboard which might not collect data, then this one is for you. Next on the list, we have Notification Dictionary. And this application comes in handy when you want to find the meaning of any word you come across, provided that word can be long pressed and highlighted. So whether in the browser, on WhatsApp, or anywhere you can highlight the text, in the options, find meaning, and you'll get a pop-up notification with the explanation of the word, which you can tap to expand and read, copy, share, and can also be read out loud. Streamlined, adjective, designed to offer little resistance to the flow of fluid, especially by having sleek, graceful lines. This is a very light and simple but very useful application that sticks in the background and works very well whenever it's needed. Check out the previous video where I also mentioned 5 amazing open source applications which are free and useful and will enhance your user experience by clicking on the card at the top right corner or on the video at the end screen. Let me know which of these applications you've been using already or if any of them is new to you. Consider subscribing to the channel if you loved the video and also leave a like and as always, thank you for watching.